Hey, what's up? This is Antonio Thompson from AntonioRThompson.com and I'm coming to you from my home office here in Brooklyn, New York. Are you trying to recruit for your business on social media, but you're not getting the results you desire? You know, no leads, no sales, no signups, no cash flow in your business. Well, in today's video, I'm gonna share with you three reasons why you suck at social media marketing and what you can do to change that. I'm actually going to a screen share right now and show you some examples of how you can actually transform your efforts on social media to get the results you desire. Desire. All right. So for this example, to show you, you know, three reasons uh, why your social media marketing sucks, I'm actually just going to use my profile. I didn't want to offend anyone by going to their profile and, and you know, highlighting everything that could be um, a challenge or problematic with it. So I'm going to use my profile as the example of, you know, what you should do and, you know, look at your profile and see if it um, it matches up to what I share. And if it doesn't, you might want to uh, make uh, some revisions to your profile so you can attract, you know, people to you and not repel them. And so social media, media marketing, it starts with your profile. Um, you know, when people are, are online and you are reaching out to them, the first thing they're going to do is come and check out your profile and stalk you and see what you're about. And so what most marketers do is their profiles are 100% or 95% all about their company, right? Their, their cover photo, you know, is XYZ company. Their profile picture is XYZ company. Or all their posts are all about XYZ company. They say they work at XYZ company. The about me section is all about XYZ company. And so when you do that, you're basically giving away the movie in the trailer and you don't want to do that you want to be the trailer and then you want to share with them the movie if they're open to it and so your cover photo should be about you you know my photo cover photo here is just you know me um traveling two different places and i say i have a quote here life is meant to be lived so live it then my profile picture is of me right it's a picture of me not my company not a rap not a tea not um you know, an avatar, my dog. No, it's me. People want to connect with a real person. My name is my name. It's not Antonio at XYZ Company. It's not XYZ Antonio Thompson Company, right? It's not, it's, it's my name. Um, additionally, what most people tend to do is where it says where you work, they have, um, you know, distributor at XYZ Company. You're, you're, you're giving away the movie. Right, people are going to come to your profile and see XYZ company. They're going to go to Google, type in XYZ company, and what comes up? XYZ company is a scam. Or if someone's doing marketing very well, um, they're going to be educated about XYZ company. And if that person, you know, is looking to join, they're going to join with that person. So you just lost out on someone who potentially could have been interested in your company, but your profile was, you know, an advertisement, walking advertisement. The other thing about um, your profile is what you share and what you post, right? You want to post things that are interesting, uh, uh, exciting, fun, um, entertaining to your audience, not all about your company, right? I rarely post anything about my company. Here's a book that I'm reading, some engagement, a vi Facebook Live video I d did sharing some value, um, inspirational quotes. Um, you know, Joe tagged me uh, this day, today because we had a, a, her anniversary for friendship. More inspirational stuff, some engagement. Um, you know, a an update on a call with the founder of Manny Chat, Andrew Warner. Curiosity, right? Got people engaging. Um, more inspirational stuff, right? An event I'm speaking at. If you don't, if you want to learn more about the event, definitely reach out to me. But an event I'm speaking at that you might want to check out: Live the Dream in Austin, Texas, Texas, August 11th to 13th. People commenting, right? Um, more stuff here. And so, when you post, share things that are of interest. They'll be in, of interest to your audience. Ask yourself before you post: Would my audience get value out of this? If it's a picture of a wrap, if it's a picture of tea, a conference call, no one's getting value at that because no one comes to Facebook looking for a conference call, an opportunity, a product, right? They come to connect, engage, and be entertained. So make sure your profile uh, is just that. And lastly, uh, you want to make sure your about me section is filled out and just tell people what you do, what you currently do, what you used to do, right? It shouldn't be, I work at you know XYZ company, you know, tell them you know, what you do. 
my past employments here. I think there's a little bio about me somewhere in here. Yeah, a little bio about me, about what I did, right? And, you know, make sure it's filled out. People are going to stalk you when you start to message them. And so if you don't have something that's um, enticing for them to see and view or it's just, you know, uh, promotional stuff, they're going to leave. All right. That's what you got to do. Share value, share inspiration, and then your profiles won't suck. Your social media marketing recruiting won't suck. And you'll actually attract more people to you to learn, who want to learn more about what you're doing in your business. Okay? So I hope you got some value out of this video. If you did, definitely drop a comment below. Let me know. But also get registered for the training that I'm, special training I'm doing this Thursday where I'm going to share with you, you know, how to become a social media rock star and attract leads, sales, signups, and recruits to you on demand even if you're brand new and even if no one knows who you are. Click the link up above or below or on the screen and get registered for the training on Thursday. I'll see you there. Peace.